Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to make some, I'm going to call Puerto Rican meatballs. And I had two pounds of ground beef. This is 90% meat and 10% fat, I think. So I'm going to put it in a bowl. And then I have some homemade sofrito in here. And I have a video on how to make homemade sofrito in case you want to learn how to make this. And also, I have an onion. This is like a small onions, which I'm going to cut it in small pieces. I have some peppers. I have the orange pepper because I don't have the green peppers. I have three um, um, garlic, some red peppers, one envelope of sazon, one large egg, a half cup of milk, one cup of um, breadcrumbs. And I'm using crackers. I'm going to cut up this and I'm going to show you. And this is what I'm using, the crackers. Okay, here is everything. I have my onions, the peppers. And you can, if you have green pepper, you can use green pepper. I have red pepper, three cloves of garlic right here, and I have my two pounds of grease. I'm going to add all my vegetables, and if you have cilantro, you can add cilantro. I'm going to add my envelope of sazon, and if you don't want to use sazon, you can use some paprika for color. I'm going to add one egg, and make sure your hands is very clean because you're going to use your hands and if you don't want to touch your meat with bare hands you can definitely use some cloth i'm going to add some adobo and if you don't have adobo you can use any seasoning you like salt or seasoning salt or whatever you have garlic powder onion powder black pepper and half cup of milk i use using one percent because that's what i have Make sure you combine everything. And then I'm going to add one cup of the um, uh, breadcrumbs, which is cracker shredded. I think it is. I hope I said it right. Now I'm going to use this ice cup, ice cream scoop. And if you don't have that, you definitely can use a scoop or just measure, measure it with your hands. Make sure your hands is wet and I'm going to form the bowls. I just using that for to measure the uh, bowls. That's it. I'm going to just run it around. I'm going to make all the bowls and I'm coming back. And I forgot to mention, you can do it a small one as you want or the size you prefer. the bowls in here now we're gonna cook this and we're gonna make a stew okay to have a saucepan in here I just add a little bit of oil I'm gonna add my sofrito and if you don't want sofrito you can definitely so cut some pepper onion cilantro Culantro. You're going to add one can of 8 ounces of tomato sauce of your preference. And with the same can, I'm going to measure approximately 2 cans of water using the, the can of a measurement. We're going to let this to come to a boil. I'm going to add some of the... Um, 
garlic powder, onion powder. I'm going to add the bay leaf, around two. Now I'm going to add the meatballs carefully. I'm not going to add the whole meatballs because I'm going to make half in there and half in the oven. So, and I'm going to let this cook. I'm going to lower the heat to medium. And I'm going to let this cook for approximately 30 minutes. Okay, 30 minutes pass and my meatballs are done. And I'm going to serve this over white rice. Here is the final result. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys, guys like this video. Bye-bye.